the music for everybody. Imagine. Like I said, if you want to dance, go and get yourself a phone. This is my phone. Oh, girl. Nora. Yeah? Why are you talking to me like that? Hey. Hey, you pass now she's talking to me now. You pass seen it too. Nora, be careful. Really? Be careful, I'm warning oh, you. I'm scared of you. I'm scared of you. Poor girl. Go and get yourself a phone. No. Ah, you do anything. Laura. What? Laura. Yes. Laura. Yes. I'm still saying my own obituary. What is happening here? Will you stop? Muna, get back to your seat. What are you people doing inside while others are outside on break? Eh? Muna, I believe you started this. Haven't I warned against this? Huh? Haven't I? But sir, she, she, she will Shut up! Shut up! You think, you think here is a dance hall? Where you come and practice African Michael Jackson? Eh? And African Sonia Day? Opening yourself, woo wa di bo Eh? Eh? Now come with me, come! Come here! Sir, it is, come. it is Laura! Will you shut up? I said shut up your mouth! Come here with me! Greetings, my queen. Yes, John. I humbly report the arrival of the Council of Elders, my queen. Okay. I'll join them shortly. Yes, my queen. You're all welcome, my dear council members. Thank you, Thank you Madam. Majesty. Thank you, my queen. Uh, but may I ask of the whereabouts of uh, Chief Patrick? Chief Ukalu, yes. It's not the duty of our queen to know the whereabouts of the Prime Minister. Thank you, Chief Gibson. Well, can we forge ahead with the meeting? Yes, Your yes. Highness. Yeah. Yes, yeah. 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 Yeah, I'm back. I assume you're going for your council meetings. Uh, yes. Okay. I am the Prime Minister. I, I do what pleases me. <laughs> After all, soon you'll be made the king. Since the ghost granddaughter of Queen Rebecca is yet to be seen. Yeah, but you know, I wish they can find her. We shut up, son. Do not wish her that. Don't you know you are the every throne? The Queen has fooled us long enough. Okay, fine. Then what if this missing granddaughter of hers is found? What will happen? Then let her present the, the princess before the council. Yes. I will see you when I come back. Thank you. Eh? I will beat her. I will make sure I beat her later today. I will flog that girl. You don't have to. She's a whack and you know it. They are all a bunch of dreads. Hey! Hi. You know I'm not good speaking in the public. But you are good in playing. Come on, your eye knows that you are good. Let's wait on the class is over. Hmm? She? Okay now. Then let's look for somewhere nice to go and have fun. Hmm? Not Come now. Come on. It's not supposed to go out for rather go inside and learn. It's not yet break time. Hey! That man, that Uncle Chris, that man hates me. I don't even know what I've done. Oh 
will I do? Just forget it. Let's go. Hmm? Okay, well, me, I can't say my own, no. That girl, she will collect this one today. I will miss I will beat her. My friend, would mind graciously for the presentation of your granddaughter and supposed princess. That is, if she exists. <sighs> I honorably urge you all for patience. For how long? Our festival is fast approaching, and we need to name and hair or heiress to the throne of Obi yes. yes. Do you think there's still much time left, my queen? My fellow council members, if I will be allowed to speak, yes. the immunity clause gives the queen the privilege to do whatever she wants to do. And in this regard, Chief Ibuma, if there was a time for you to be more elaborate in your speech, that time is now. Tell him. There's no need for sarcasm. My late son had a daughter before he died, and I'm aware of it. The mother of the child, that's the my granddaughter, the mother to my granddaughter, relocated recently. I'm sure I'll find her and I'll present to you, your princess, the heiress. <coughs> well, my fellow council members, let your patience be patient. Hmm? Let's grant the queen demands. <laughs> we heard you, Prime Minister. <laughs> you pick on me always. You mock me. Why? What have I done to you? Now it's my time. You have been on my neck. You think you are the only beautiful girl. Huh? Ah, you guys should stop. Mona, let's go. Just leave me alone. I don't want to fight any of you. Am I the only one from a poor background? Am I? Mona, it's okay. She was angry you won her, that's all. Really? Yes. I've warned you both. Stay away from me. It's so absurd. Please be calm, my queen. Let's be positive. I am under pressure here. Can't you get it? I mean, if I cannot present her before the council or during the festival, then the royal leadership of this kingdom will be retracted. And Williams will be made the heir apparent to the throne. Greetings, my queen. Oh. Gladly I come with good news. Come on, let it out. They've been found. Somewhere oh. in the suburb. Oh my goodness. Then what are we waiting for? Let's let's move now. Um, please get my hand back. Okay. Come on.
My princess. Children, it's okay, it's okay. Stop playing with my princess. Eh? Can't you see she's just coming back from school? My princess, go home. Hmm. Hmm. I'm going already. But this is your I'm princess of a thing. I don't understand it. <laughs> Are you not my princess? You're my princess. But wait, though. Uncle Mike, mm. why are you always calling me my princess, my princess, my princess, my princess, my princess? Why? Nothing. Just my spirit directed me to call you my princess. That's why I'm calling you my princess. Okay. Is it bad for me to call you my princess? I know so it's bad though. It's not a bad thing though. Just that my mother is always calling me my princess. That's why. It's okay. Go home now. Hmm? Go home and rest. My princess. You see? Again, <laughs> my princess. Okay, bye. Okay, bye. Bye. My brother, you don't have to be acting like a chicken. Yes. Do you know what you're talking about? To be the heir apparent to the throne of Optimo Kingdom. This is what every every full-born, full-fledged human being, male of this kingdom, will accept with, with all dignity. Listen, Ken, I know that. But that will only happen if the queen does not provide that girl. Huh? Then let us pray she doesn't surface. Yes. See, my friend, I want you to. You have to be brave and you have to you, you have to be brave and strong. Yes. See, if you know all the efforts your uncle is making, every effort he's making for you to be king, you will sit up. Do you know? If your parents were to be alive now, they would have made you the king. You know that. I agree with you. You're right. But you see, there's a tradition in this land. After the, after the death of King Jason, okay. you know, Richard was supposed to be the king. Richard is no more. Meaning that any um, child of Richard is supposed to take over the throne. But if he does not have any child, it is left for either me or my father. Right? Uh -huh. Good. But right now, the queen is saying that the princess is coming back. Then let her so please, let us see. Let us show, let her show her face. I know I'm saying this, oh. You have to be strong. See, if I ever have my way, I will make sure that that girl disappears forever. Hey, hey, no, 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 yes. no, 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 please. Don't even say that again. Ken, I am begging you. This is not my style. No, no, I don't want that. No, don't, don't, don't even think about it. No, 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 please. Please, let's just go, but just take, take that out of your mind. I've heard everything you said, fine, but... <sighs> I have to sit up, all right? I, 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 seriously, I, I want you to be the king. I know, I know. who I am. I'm a young girl with great vision. But those people, they are always looking for my trouble, always insulting me, and I don't want to fight. Mm, don't need it, okay? Do not fight with anybody. All you need to do is to read your books and make your grades, okay? Thank you. But I'm not a real life princess. So why are you always calling me my princess? Hey, did you tell Uncle Mike to call me princess too? No, did he call you that? Mm-hmm. Um, now go inside, get your shoe. So you can have your lunch. Okay? My princess. <laughs> <laughs> my princess.
There's a road cut ahead. The road is bad. So my queen will trek. It's okay, it's okay. Let's, let's go. Let's go. Come on. Let's go. This is all tricks. There is no child anywhere. By the time you and my fellow elders will wake up and realize that Queen Rebecca is a very smart queen, the better for us. Then what do you suggest? Let's deny her another chance. If she doesn't produce the princess before the upcoming festival, then we'll have every reason to install my, my nephew. <laughs> you are rather cunning, indeed. Yes. If I may say. And you didn't say your mind in that, huh? Kai. I know. What I mean is, next time she demands for time. Yes. Let's deny her that. Good. Okay? Yeah. You know how much I value that throne for my nephew. If we get it, you stand to gain a lot. That's great. So think twice. You know I'm always on your side. My dear Patrick. Ha! <laughs> How are you? I'm fine, ma. And how's my granddaughter, your daughter, doing? She just stepped up now, ma. You're welcome. Please, what can I offer you? Water, food, anything, my queen. Sit down. Why did you relocate without informing me? I've been searching for both of you since. Please forgive me, my queen. Things were so bad for us, we couldn't survive it. We had to move. Remember you asked me to keep Mona's secret. I'm sorry. It's okay. How did you find us, Ma? I can always find my way around things. Well, I'll have to wait until my granddaughter gets back. Okay, ma. Let me find you. Oh, hey, no. Calm down. Sit down. <laughs> I'm glad to see you. See me, ma. <laughs> Where are you going? Stay here. You can't go in there. Ah. Uh, go this way. Why? Who are you? And what are you doing here? My name is Peter. The Chief Security Officer to Queen Rebecca. The ruler of Obimo Kingdom. May I know you please? <clears throat> well... Well, I am Muna. Muna Richards. Oh, my princess. My princess, you may go in at once. Princess? Yes, you're my princess. I greet you. <laughs> go in at once. 
Princess Muna. <laughs> yes. I know I I did ask you to keep it a secret, but sometimes things happen. That's right. Oh, you, my goodness! This is my granddaughter. You're all grown up now. <laughs> Um, my princess, my love. Um, um, can, can we talk? Excuse me. Mom, there's no need. Just say what you want to say here. <clears throat> um, <sighs> look at me. <sighs> She's your grandmother, the mother of your late father. She's the ruler of Obimo Kingdom. I don't understand. She is my grandmother, the ruler of Obimo Kingdom. Then who was my father? Your father was my late son, the heir to the throne of Obimo Kingdom. Wait, mommy. When I asked you if I'm a real life princess, you said no. Why did you lie to me? My princess, it's not what you think, okay? This is not the right time for all this. Yes, it's time. My dear, you are a true life princess. The throne of Obimo rests on your shoulders. Yes. And you must come and claim it. Yes, my love. No, you are not my grandma, and you can never be. Just, just leave. Hi, Muna. Forgive me, my queen, please. The queen is doing all this because I don't have a child. Patrick, stop this. Even if you do have a child, you will not jump the line, okay? Yes. The tradition says that only when the dynasty of Jason ends shall another take over. Has it not ended? Richard died a long time ago. When will Rebecca stop fooling the entire kingdom? I don't think she'll stop doing that. Yes, because we all know the woman Richard impregnated. That King Jason refused him to marry. Then let the child show up. You people underrate the smartness of Queen Rebecca. I, I'm telling you, you underestimate that woman. She could go out there and borrow a child and present before the council. Then, that's when your smartness is needed. To make sure the child is Richard's. Yes. Hey, my queen, I'm sorry, please. Helen, Forgive her. calm down. Calm down. Calm down. I understand how she feels. Um, now, you go in, take care of her, take care of yourself, right? Okay, you, I'll be back. Thank you, ma. Um, your cars. Oh. Uh, there's a, a road cut over there, so we had to park on the other side of the road. That's the wrong road, ma. Let me show you the right one in case of next time. Okay, all right. Let's go. Okay. security to Queen Rebecca. And my queen, just before the road cuts, there's a, a turn by your right. 
just follow it down to lead it to my house. Yes. Take care of yourself. Thank you, Ma. Bye bye. Robin. What's wrong? What are those people doing there? Robin, I'm lost. Cool down, cool down, cool down. Just talk to me. I feel neglected and lonely. I am so happy. I mean, who could have been you, Come on, granddaughter. I told you, my queen, that I will find them. Yes, Peter. You've done well. You have done marvelously well. <laughs> my queen. So when is she coming back home? Oh, pretty soon. Sooner than expected. Now I can take the council members boldly. <laughs> Muna, I trusted you. I believed you. And now look, is this what I get? Listen, it's not what you think. I can explain. Explain what? What do you want to explain? You prefer lying to me than saying the truth? Is that it? You. I hate you. I hate you. I hate that woman. I hate this kingdom. I don't want to rule any kingdom. I hate all of you. Muna. 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 Muna, come back here. Muna, I said, come back here. Listen, my love. It's your best right. You can't say no to it. If you say no, a lot of things will go wrong. Can't you understand? Muna. I'm sorry. I don't care. Muna! Muna! Come on, but... You are here to tell me why you are feeling this bad about her. I have not seen you look this unhappy since all my life. Robin, you will not understand. But I feel so hot. Okay, you don't want to tell me. So, who are those people back there? They are Piad Royal. That was the queen. Queen of the okay, that's her, uh, but what did that highly queen come to do with you and your mother? I hope she didn't come to pick you as one of her palace maidens. Never. If she did, she wouldn't have come. Okay. But she coming to your house is an honor. Okay, Robin. Let me tell you. She actually came because... My princess! My princess! Uncle Mike! My princess! My princess, what is it? You don't look cheerful, I suppose. What is it? Uncle Mike, how did you find out? Ah, my princess. I don't believe you don't have television at home. Hmm? Or don't you watch news? We don't have to. Okay, you two are confusing me now. What is going on? My princess, may your days be long. You will rule us well. Fukumai. Your secrets will be safe with me.
Okay, Muna. Why did your Komai just bow to you? And what secret is he talking about? I want her to have her own chamber, so you will need to furnish it very well. Yes, my queen. <laughs> and to you, Peter, from now on, you'll be picking her up from her home to school until she comes to live here with us. Hmm? Okay, my queen. One more thing, John. I'll need you to employ two maids, especially for the princess. Yes, my queen. Um, the secretary to the state is waiting. Oh! That reminds me. I had an appointment with him. Well, tell him I'll be with him shortly. Hmm? Yes, my queen. Alright. I think that will be all. your late father. I didn't know he was a prince, an heir to the throne. Hello. Hi. Good afternoon, sir. Oh, yeah, good afternoon. My name is Richard. I am a researcher. I came to this village to do a research. Oh, you're welcome, sir. I'm Helen. I live in this village. Okay, that's good. Oh, I'm so happy to see a beautiful woman like you reading. Thank you, but that is what I do for a living. Um, are you a student or something? Oh, yes, I'm a student. Uh, oh, let me help you. <laughs> no, sir. Thank you. I can do it. No, let me... no, no. I don't want you to enjoy yourself. Oh? <laughs> <laughs> I'm fine. No, let me, let me help you. Let me. This help is you. my work. Let me help you. Hey, no, <laughs> sir. Please, oh. <laughs> I don't want you to enjoy yourself. No, yeah? I won't. I, I. Okay, don't worry. Hey! Oh, yeah, my starter. Sir, okay, take this one. <laughs> oh, yes. Thank you. I'm not doing it. Uh, I don't have to do it. I can do it very well. It's okay now. I'm, I'm
not saying the woman that is as hard working like you all my life. Hey, and I've never seen a student that is as strong as you are. Not all students will have the strength to win the farm the way you did today. <laughs> it's because my parents are very poor. I'm from a poor, they cannot even afford my school fees. So I have to, I have to do this mini job to sponsor myself in school. Sorry, same here. My parents are poor. <laughs> I'm a poor girl, but it is well. <laughs> This car passed earlier, and now it's passing again. I don't mind all, all the produce we need because they have money to buy the big cars. They will just be passing. They are all courtists. No! <laughs> don't say that, Richard. Not every big man is evil. Besides, you can see the plate number of that car is covered. It could be somebody very important. Yes, you could be right. You could be right. Oh, but what we'll makes you think not all true rich men are cautious? Hmm. Richard, I know people say that every rich person is a courtist. But I don't believe that. Do you know why? I know I am poor. I'm a poor girl. But. I know I must definitely make it in the future. And if someday I make it and buy myself a car like that, people will start saying she's evil. She has done something. Just like you are. Yes, you are a student now. In the future, you might make it. Um, you can as well get yourself a car like that. So it's not every rich person is evil. <sighs> You're very intelligent and violent. How come you're in school? I know. Nobody to sponsor my education. Nobody to help me. That is why I'm doing this my farm work. At least, I'm using it to assist my poor mom and myself. Don't worry, I'm fine. I know you must be very thirsty. Uh, follow me to my house. Let me at least offer you water. Oh? What? What? Please do. You know I'm from a very poor home. Our house is very poor. I don't want you to insult me. <laughs> come on, come on, let's go. Stop it. Let's go. Okay, what make you think your house is not better than my house? No, I know my house. Lawrence is not that good at all. <laughs> but you manage it. <laughs> yeah, let's go, let's go. Now. He deserves a better cup than this thing. How can I serve him with this? Oh. Be proud of yourself. Be proud of what you are. Give me the water with the cup, I'll drink it. How did you get here?
thank you very much for the water and your help. Thank you, Richard. I'm, I'm very sorry I couldn't offer you more. You know I'm a poor girl, please forgive me. No, stop apologizing for being real. See, you, I, I don't know what to say. I like you for that, being yourself. Not faking yourself, but just real. So listen, you inspired me. These are the kind of people I want to see. Uh, oh God. Thank you so see, much. Listen, listen. Uh, because of this, we are not friends. Yes, I want us to be friends. And I will always come to this place to visit you. Thank you. See me often. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> well, what of your, your research? Are you done with it? Oh. When, when are you submitting? Oh, yes. Um, I am done. I really acquired a lot. Yes. And I've compiled my report, everything. Oh, I will submit very soon. Yeah, very, very soon. But I will still need your help. This car again. This car keeps passing around my village. Uh, it's starting to look weird, Richard. Yes. The same thing I told you before that these rich people with big cars, see, they are all caught. See, listen, please, you have to go home now. I don't want anything to happen to you. Please. No, Richard, I'm, I'm fine. Nothing will happen to me. I'm fine. This is my village. Nothing will happen to me. Sure. I'm fine. Trust me. Let me walk you down. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Richard, yes. I don't know. Something in me tells me that you are really a nice person. Wow, same thing. Something in me also tells me that you are a nice person. Thank you. Now let me walk you. Walk to that junction, then you go back. My hour will be going so that if I get to my junction, we don't meet your junction. Okay, <laughs> <laughs> thank you so much for coming around and for managing a poor thank girl you for making me so I happy. Mean. Listen, we're both poor. only a man that can make me smile. Hmm. I am not a child. I know you, my daughter. Hmm? Okay, Mama, you win. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Say something, I'm, I'm listening to you. His name is Richard. Mm -hmm. I met him today. He's like a brother to me, Mama. Mm -hmm. Mama, I've never met a guy that is as simple and free as he is. <laughs> but please, don't go and put over pepper in that soup because no, of this your smile. My word, my better half, you mean so much to me. Richard, there's a problem. <sighs> problem. 
What is the problem? Tell me. I really don't know how to say this to you. <laughs> really? Just say it the way you want. <laughs> Some more courage and tell me. See, there is nobody here. We are alone in this place. So I'm listening. Say it. Richard. Do you love me? I mean, how much do you love me? What? I love you so much with all my heart. See, as far as I'm concerned, right now, you're the best thing that is happening in my life. You mean so much to me. I love you more than I love myself. Yes. Okay, fine. Oh, let me prove it. No, no, no. Richard, no. I don't want your money. I, 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 I know I'm a poor girl, but it's not your money. I don't want your money. Richard, I'm pregnant for you. I'm not giving you money, but this. <laughs> you made me so happy. You made me so proud. Now you are going to make me a father. God! <laughs> Will you marry me? Yes. <laughs> yes, Richard. <laughs> <laughs> My son, Mama. you've taken the right step. Thank you very much. Thank you, Mama. You're welcome. Thank you very much. <laughs> uh, Mama, I want to take her to my place tomorrow so she can meet my people. It's okay. Do you think I would not like your people? I knew you would like them. <laughs> <laughs> they, are very, they are good people. Mm. Yes, good people. Um, Mama, please, I want you to help me put things in place so that I can come with my people to see you. It's okay. I will have to talk to her father's brothers, then communicate to you. Thank you once more. You're welcome. You're welcome. <clears throat> <laughs> Mama <laughs> Come here. <laughs> Richard. Is this not the same car that has been passing around my village? Richard, what is happening? Oh, uh, Helen, let's go inside and meet my parents. Your parents? Wait. <laughs> you mean your parents <sighs> stays here? Helen, this is King Jason's company, the ruler of Obimo Kingdom. I am his only son, the heir apparent to the throne of Obimo Kingdom. Yes. What? Richard, you lied to me. Richard, why did you lie to me? Richard, I don't even know you. Please don't. No, 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 no. Stop, stop it, stop it, stop it, stop it, stop it, stop it, stop it. Let's go. Let's go. See, listen, listen to me. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm really sorry. I had to lie to you. I am sorry. I had to lie to you because I want to know the real you. 
I am in search of a good woman. So I disguised myself. I was the one that came to your village with this car. When I saw you at the farm, I told my driver to drive past you. I came down and walked up to you in disguise. Just to know the real you. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Richard, why do you have to lie to me? Why? Look at me. Is this how I'm going to face a prominent king and queen dressed like this? No, let me go. Stop, stop, stop. Richard, allow me to go. Helen, look into my eyes and listen to me. The most important thing is we are here and I know very well that my parents, they will love you the way they love me. I already told them we are coming today and they are expecting us. Relax. Just relax yourself. All you need to do for me now is to breathe in, breathe in, breathe in. Breathe in, breathe in. Yeah, breathe out, breathe out. Mm -hmm. Compose yourself. Relax yourself. Now, behave like a princess. Let's go. Let's go, relax. Relax, relax. relax. Let's go, let's go. Let's go. So how was that? It was okay. It was fine. I think everything is went well. <laughs> it went well. <laughs> okay, that's all right. Great to see you back, Oh, my friends. May you live long, my king of queen. Oh, oh. <laughs> Put it on. <laughs> oh, that's all right. Yes, oh, Dad, this is Helen, the woman that has taken my heart away. What? Richard. Are you out of your mind? No, Dad, I don't get you. How dare you? How dare you, a first-class prince, bring this thing you call a girl before my presence and you even introduced her as your woman? Jason, please, let's talk about this inside. Please. Okay. I shall go nowhere. I shall go nowhere. In the first place, Younger. Highness. Your Highness. Who are you? Where are you from? Who are your parents? Your Highness. I'm from Ubi. The only surviving daughter. The late Lady Boko, sir. Can you hear that? My dear, can you hear that? They are not familiar to me at all. They are not. Can you see the kind of girl my son brought before my presence? Young man. I am very sorry, my son. We never marry you, okay? Go and give her food, if you will. Give her enough money to take care of herself. But she has to leave this compound immediately. Do I make myself clear? Jason, this is not right. Son, this will be it for the last time. You will disappoint me again. That you will do no such thing to her. Daughter, put yourself together. Stop all this. If he really loves you, he will fight for you. He will fight to make you his wife. 
his father cannot marry you for him. You see why I'm not like a man? Why do you? Why do you? My daughters, this happened in the life of every girl. If your heart is not broken by any man, that means you've not started life at all. Please wait and see if he will come back for you. Oh? But what, what if he doesn't come back? What will happen to my baby? Will I have my baby out of wedlock? We will leave everything for God. Just stop crying so you don't fall sick. Oh? Stop crying. This is what happened to the life of poor people. We <coughs> abandoned you because you are from a poor home. It's okay. Oh, Mama. <laughs> the tears of the poor. Oh, give my love. Oh, give my love. See that? I will give my love. The poor always cry. How are you? Hi. How are you, baby? Chuku, 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 chuku. Nom, 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 nom. <laughs> oh, you don't drive yourself. Uh, uh, for now. For now. I, I don't want anybody to know where you and the baby is, except my mother and I. Why? Are you afraid? Does your father want to kill me? Uh, no, not my father. Uh, his enemies. You see, uh, you will not understand the case at hand. Uh, the news of the baby has spread. And they all know that my father does not want you. So my mother and I have decided to take you and the baby away from here. Don't worry, don't worry. Oh, I bought some things for you. I'll, I'll, I'll get in the later. Okay, let's go inside. Okay? <laughs> Have you given him food this morning? Yes. Eh? Yes. Don't worry, okay. Everything will be fine. We'll just try to put one or two things together. Okay? Don't worry, just a bandit. <laughs> Helen, how are you doing and how is my granddaughter doing? Fine, ma. What about you? I'm well. Thank God. Uh, I know it's been a while, I mean, since after the King's burial. Uh, well, I decided to send for you just to intimate you about the matter that's on hand. Gemma, I'm all ears. No, please, uh, let me explain to her. No, 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 no. Let me talk to her. Hmm? <sighs> Helen, I know it's been hard on you. But the, the Mom, truth please, must be told. Please, Mom, yes. please just go straight to the point, please. Uh, Helen, listen, in fact, my 
father placed the cost on me before he died. And that cause is supposed to take effect if I marry you. Helen, Helen, it, it has not come to that. It has not come uh, to that. Mom, 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 I can't take this anymore. I can't. I'd rather die in that cause. Not marry her. No, 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 son. Don't say that. Don't say that. Um, you see, Helen, what, what, what I'm saying is that He wants my baby. Please, please, Helen, please. Helen. Open the door. Open. Open the I'm sorry, I'm, I'm sorry! Richard, leave me alone! This is it, right? This is why you've been so cold to me! Uh, that's going to mean that all you and your family wanted is the baby. I will never let it happen. No! I was cold and sick over what my father said! I and my mother have not rested over this! I will marry you no matter what happens to me. It's not, no from, matter your heart. Heart. It's not from your heart, Richard. Just go, go, go and marry whether your family wants you to marry. Leave us alone. Leave us alone. Leave no. Us alone. no one is persuading me. No. no one is persuading me to marry anyone. I felt bad. And why would my father go to this land? Listen, I will do anything. Anything. If it means going to check my blood, my last blood, I will do anything to make sure nobody takes away our baby away from you. And both of you will come back to the palace. Yes. Yes. You are my wife. I will marry you and let that cause her.
Who are you and what do you want here? Sir, I'm um, Helen. The, the girl Richard is to marry. Are you the one the king rejected before he died? Please, uh, I, I want to see the queen. I just got a, a message. The prince is dead. <laughs> Which I understand. I suffered to raise you all by myself. This year you'll be 16. It is time for you to rule your people. Why haven't I seen her here before? Because I lost her contacts. I lost virtually everything. My phone. And I was warned never to return to the palace again. So I had to run down to this place to hide you. Listen, she has suffered to find us here. You are only 16. It is their law for you to rule from 16. I should be there to direct you. Okay? But the king hated you. I don't feel happy about this. I wish I knew I'm a princess. My life won't be like this. It would have been different. I know. I know. You are still very young, okay? Listen, the queen has suffered so much to find us. You have to give her a chance. I'm very happy that our suffering has ended. Please, you can't let it slide away. Huh? Please. Please. Well, um, John, you'll have to go do some shopping for Princess Mona today. Yes, my queen. Her size will be needed. Um, you know, just... Get her something nice. I mean, you know her, so just try and get her something nice. Hmm? Okay, my queen. And please call me Peter. Yes, my queen.
Yes, Peter, you'll have to leave right away. You go and take uh, Princess Mona to school. I'll make you with the other driver. Okay, my queen. I'll leave at once. Yeah, um, so Dad, tell me, how did you find out that she didn't succeed? So, I have my informant in the palace. She did not see the girl. So we have to celebrate. Begin to see yourself as a future king of this man. <laughs> you know, I would be so happy if this information is true. Hi. Yeah. It me that you are so dull. Your late father wasn't like this. You have to be strong. Why are you sounding like this? Listen, I am strong. My fear was that um, after parading myself as the heir apparent to the throne, a little girl would just come from nowhere and take over the kingdom. I am telling you now. One of the maids informed me. I have two of them in my house. I'm still expecting the other one to come and give, give me her information. On one premise, I promise them that you're going to marry. <laughs> you told them that. But of course, you know I will not marry any of them. Okay. If you want to marry them, fine. If you don't want to marry them, no problem. Begin to see yourself as my future king. That's it. That's the main thing. That's it. <laughs> Good morning, madam. Oh, good morning. How are you? I'm fine. I'm here by the order of the queen to take Princess Mona to school. Oh, wow. Oh. She has left for school already. Oh. It's okay. Let me run along. I need to pick up the queen. Do take good care of yourself. You too, huh? All right. I don't know if you can believe this. You mean your girl is a real life princess? <laughs> I can't believe yeah. this. I put a million on whoever I can. I can't believe it. Even she herself? No, no. Mm. Man. Wow. Even to the extent of being an heiress to the throne. Is that what they're trying to tell us? What? An heiress to the most wealthy and popular kingdom in this community? Eh? Hey. Now, hmm? me breaking this news to you guys is hmm? not to start seeing her as a princess. I get over there. Hmm? Hmm. Now, two of you and our clique to start seeing me as a king. Hmm? Abi, I hail you. Now. My bros, I hail you. Your bros? My king, I hail you. You <laughs> need to hold on this girl tight. Don't let her escape. You know you both have been so close. Tell her now. Uh -uh. You know that you're a bad boy. You don't need me. You don't need me to tell you what you have to do. You suppose no waiting. You go of do. Of course. Me. Use your brain. Not for you. You the fuck up. Nah. Come on, come on. Boy, we don't move. Sir. Yes. You made me. I promise that if I told you everything happened in the palace, you'll make me proud. Yes. I was the one that put you in that job. So I know what I'm going to do for you. But tell me the truth. Did she find the princess? Yes, she did. Are you sure of what you're telling me? Because I heard that she didn't find him. I went with her to the ghetto. I saw her myself. She has grown into a beautiful lady. Soon she'll be returning back to the palace. I can't believe this. So the story was true? Yes. I know there. I can even take you to that place. No, 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 no. You have done all I expect of you. 
All you have to do now is tell me the address. Let me visit them myself. Okay, sir. Okay? I announced the arrival of the council. What? It's not your time for them to come. Why are they here? I can't tell my queen. If I may speak, my queen. I think someone is selling us out. They might have heard about the kidnap of the princess. 